Welcome back to part 3 of our multimeter series. Today, we're checking the fuse, a small but important piece that helps protect your car's wiring. In part 1, we covered how to test your battery, and in part 2, how to test the relay. Once you've located your fuse box, set your multimeter next to it. There's a guide behind the fuse box cover. It tells you what each fuse and relay is for. Let's pull one out so you can see it up close. You can do a quick visual check. If the metal strip inside is broken or burned, the fuse is blown. But sometimes, the damage isn't obvious. That's where the multimeter helps. Set your multimeter to continuity mode. That's the one with the symbol that looks like a sound wave. Touch one probe to each side of the fuse. Polarity doesn't matter here. If the fuse is good, you'll hear a beep or see a reading close to zero. That means electricity can flow through. No beep or the screen says OL or shows a very high number, that fuse is blown and needs to be replaced. You can also test the fuse while it's up, just to be sure. Touch one probe to each metal end. It's the same process. And that's it. Simple and reliable. Stay tuned for the next part of our multimeter series. We still have a few tests to cover.